Hi Virgo. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. How are you guys? Hope you're all doing well. Virgo, this is going to cover the next two weeks, October 12th, oh my goodness, to the 25th, 2020 for Virgo. And if the reading doesn't resonate for you, Virgo, you could definitely watch your other signs. I'm using the Witches Tarot. And Virgo, those of you that would like to get a private reading, you follow me on Facebook, Instagram, for weekly live readings. I would love to have you there. And every year on Halloween night, I do a, this will be the fourth year, a Halloween party on my Facebook page. Gifts. It's so much fun. I would love to have you guys there. Links are below. Virgo. Virgo Spirit. October 12th to the 25th for Virgo. Way too many. Beautiful. All right, perfect. Central issue, Two of Pentacles, your foundation, Six of Cups reversed, and we will be clarifying, recent past, Seven of Wands, crowning you, wow, nice, Eight of Wands, Justice, sign of Libra, which we're in right now. Travel for business for some of you, even if it's just for fun. You know, the Eight of Wands is flight travel, internet communication. You could have met someone online and with justice, they definitely could be a Libra or you will be meeting this person in Libra season. This could also be a big creative spark and implementing something legally like you're contracting yourself to the internet with a partner or someone. If not, it could just be travel, travel for work. It could also be very fast paced communication, things going, well, definitely things going back and forth very, very quickly. Emails, text messaging, anything that's like back and forth. Some of you definitely need to make a decision. Two of Pentacles, Justice. And this could be in love or career. I do not see, I just don't see this as juggling. You know, when I look at this card in this deck, it, it's like, it's like, it, it's like it tells me, what, what do you do with your hands? You know, they're raised. Like, waiting for some sort of sign. It's emotional. Even though it's a Pentacles card, there is a lot of water. It's definitely emotional. Okay, and you guys, so you guys have fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, and Leo, or Libra, I'm sorry. I feel like this person is looking to the heavens for a sign on what on what to do within a practical situation, whether it's financial or it's just like a daily routine. There is a solid direction, but right now you can't see it. You know, it's weird. It's like... 
you're on you're on a current path and then there's this ball of 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 like light and energy kind of preventing you or them from seeing what's beyond your eyes you you really can't see what 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 it is right now with the 6 of cups i actually feel instead of you clinging to your past i'm feeling and seeing you let go with this eight of wands. You know, the, the, the wands are shooting into the universe. They're like going away from old energy and into a positive shift moving forward. Those of you that are Trying to decide between two people. You are going to get a burst of inspiration. But whoever it, it's it's from. I think it's definitely from someone from the past. With the Seven of Wands. You may probably need to fight for something. But it's more about op options. As opposed to. What do you do with your life? And some of you could be getting divorced, but I honestly don't get that. That it's a negative thing. It could just be that now everything is final. Justice is upright. Things are final. You can move forward. Before you weren't sure which path you were going to take. But in the near future, it looks like you get complete balance and justice for your situation, whatever it is. Some of you will get justice in terms of maybe your children, child support. It could even be two children that, that you're trying to. Because it, the Two of Pentacles is balance. You know, you're definitely trying to balance the scales. There is balance, guys, which is awesome. Let's clarify this. Okay, yeah, let's start with the Six of Cups. Interesting reading for you guys. Um, the Silver Witchcraft Tarot. I feel like you make something happen. Six of Cups reversed for Virgo. I don't like that one. And I want to... I'm going to look at this Seven of Wands. Okay. And Justice. Whoa. Honest to God, I can't even make this shit up. Well, isn't that just beautiful? Okay, the Six of Cups reversed. Okay, the Nine of Pentacles reversed. Some of you were very, very worried, nervous. Or it's possible that you felt like maybe your children were not okay. But that's what's in your head. And it's in the reverse. It's old energy. It's in the foundation. That's moving away. And I want you guys to understand, you know, when I say it's all in your head, you know, you were thinking the absolute worst of a situation, especially if you're going through a divorce. Or with the Seven of Wands, this is maybe you were fighting someone. But with the Four of Cups, I definitely, you got tired of fighting. And you, you amicably solved, you found, you amicably are, are finding solutions and with the Ace of Swords, listen, this is a, a new beginning. Communication, victory. You got what you wanted. Justice has been served. They're both legal cards. Beautiful energy, spiritual energy. And this Ace of Swords, look, you got your wings. 
Beautiful. Still, again, could be a Libra, or this is a time frame for you. But there is a lot of air energy moving on with the Eight of Wands. Some of you could be literally moving with your children, and that absolutely could have something to do with why you're fighting, fighting in court, finding a way to make it happen, and you absolutely do, and that's amazing. You absolutely find a way to make it work for you, Virgo. I said that from the beginning. Unbelievable. Um, which is wisdom I'm going to pull for you guys. Beautiful, beautiful deck. Look at that manifestation. That's exactly what you're going to do. You're manifesting a brand new beginning. You are making it happen. Unbelievable. Can't even make that up. You're definitely manifesting a new beginning. Out with the old, in with the new. Awesome. Virgo, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please be sure to subscribe. Absolutely adore you guys, and I'll see you back here with your love monthlies. Take care.